morning everybody welcome back to my channel my name is sandra thank you for joining me today for this morning's plan with me or this week's plan with me i should say so um i think what i wanted to do was give a review on how my previous week has gone so far or how my week has gone since the last time we spoke even um except i took out all of my planning pages in here up till may the beginning of may and I also wanted to um, put this quote in here. This is actually from Matthew McConaughey. It says, it's time to revive your soul, awaken your spirit and re-engineer your thinking so you can catch more green lights in your life. I just, that was from that huge promotion ad thing that he had like last week. And I thought that was very catching. I've kind of gone through and crossed off some things I wanted to, to look at and work on throughout the, like for the monthly pages. But um, for now, and this is what my week kind of looked like and I didn't actually make any changes to this I mean we're still on Thursday right so um it's going to be a busy day today I was asked to go to the park after my son's school like after I picked him up with my kids but I don't know it's going to be 29 degrees celsius here and my baby is not allowed to be like he shouldn't be when it out when it's really really warm like that because of his condition so I'm not sure um, they said that like really hot weather can affect and just make sure that he has lots to drink, but it's not like he can pop a Gatorade, you know what I mean? So, um, yeah, but anyway, today is busy. My husband has a sleep apnea appointment and then tomorrow I have his immunization still. And then I'm also, I think I forgot to write this down last time, but I'm taking my car in on the weekend. Um, something's happening to my vehicle again. Like I hear some like metal rattling around and it's not, doesn't sound safe. <laughs> I mean, my vehicle is old now. It's like 2013. Yeah. 2013. I didn't realize how old it was, but anyway, here's my Monday. So I'll just kind of let you look at that. I mean, it did pretty well. Everything. I don't know why I keep forgetting to transfer tasks forward, but actually I did cut the pineapple that night and I can't remember did I do those I think I actually did these as well okay so anyway that was really good I hadn't done my financials for my business because my one of my things hadn't like transferred over yet into my accounting program so I just left it um, but yeah, really, really busy. It was busy. My mom came over and I didn't, I felt like I didn't get a lot done. Maybe I didn't get those two things done. I can't remember now. No, I didn't. Wow. I don't know why I'm using whiteout to basically tell myself I didn't get something done, but I'm doing it. And I can't use that pen because it doesn't write, the ink doesn't write well over whiteout. So yeah, so I didn't, I remember feeling very, um, not unhappy, but it was a, it was a rough day because the kids were crazy and, um, it was because my mom was over and we had found a bird. Um, hopefully it'll be quiet. It's still sleeping right now. <laughs> um, we had found a budgie outside of our house and we brought it in my mom got a cage for it. And now we have an unofficial pet bird. His name is Tony or her name is Tony. I don't know. I'm confused, but anyway, she's just a tiny little thing and really, really sweet. But right now she's sleeping. I have her cage covered, so hopefully she doesn't wake up until I'm done because she can be loud. <laughs> um, okay, so this is Tuesday. Um, this was also a really good, this was my first really, really super productive week. So I got everything done again except the financials, and then I got all of this extra stuff done. Okay, and then the, this was yesterday. So um, again, everything done. And it, again, it was a really good day. And also I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start tracking when he's eating, sleeping, going to the bathroom, all that stuff. Um, so I can have more information when we go to his appointments and I can tell them like, this is what he's been doing. Um, you know, this is how gassy he was today. Like just a, like a rundown of every single day. So I think that's important. So I can go back to my planner and be like, yep, yeah, here, here, here. He was good, here, 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 he wasn't. So, and then this is today. This is what I have planned. Um, I have to pay the bills. That's why I highlighted it because it's like one of the most important tasks for today. And um, a little bit of work stuff. So I did actually get some blog brainstorm done yesterday. 
I did lots of filming. Well, between the last two days, I think I filmed. Yeah, I did. I did a reel on Instagram and I did a YouTube short. That was my Hob Hobonichi flip through for April. And I did my budget, did that. Um, and then I also printed out these stickers. I'm going to show you guys in this video. Again, this is part of the intro, you guys. I'll get into the meat of things in a minute here. But so I was watching Lisa Love Studio. And she had done this collaboration with Plan So Cute from Etsy, where Plan So Cute only sells digital files of stickers. And then you have to download them. And if you own a Cricut or Silhouette, you can cut them yourself. And I feel like a lot of people are going that route. So Lisa said, why don't I buy those from you or let's collab and I will print them and sell them. So I'm sure she's making money and Plants So Cute is making money off of that. And I thought that was a really good idea. But I, for me, I don't need to purchase them like that because I can cut my own and print my own. So that's what I did. I took out all of the ones I liked. Um, she kind of has like a very kawaii style. So I didn't print like the little animal ones because they reminded me too much of kawaii. And it's not really my thing. Um, but these ones, these are so cute. These are like the little girls that kind of remind me of the little Koras I use or even the little munchkins. Um, or also the prairie girls from the Prairie Planner. I love those ones too. I like them because they have color. And um, yeah, Let's Plan It. Most of them, like they're all black and white. And they're kind of the same idea though with all the little girls and stuff. Um, and then this one you get like a full 8 by 10 sheet. So you cut it into quarters that's why these sheets are so small but you still get quite a few stickers on one sheet and so like I have a variety of things here I've got ones for working I've got um planning laundry I have chores what else do I have um happy meal um this one was the doctor was it the doctor yeah, this is the doctor appointment. So you get two sheets of these and like two sheets of these. And in my Hobonichi, I'm also going to use some weather icons. I'm going to start writing down the weather just so I have a memory of like what how hot it was. And so kind of like a memory of what we did that day too. Okay, and then I've got date night. There is shaving time, which I thought like a lot of these stickers would be good in my self-care planner for my melody. So the shaving would definitely be one. Um, there's print and cut stickers here. And then also, um, where was it? This is a coffee one. This is groceries. There was another self-care one, and I can't remember if it was in the big ones, maybe. So this is a spring one, which I thought was so cute. I can use those as my planner. And then also this one here, a spa day. So a whole bunch of different things. And then this one's cut or watering plants, which I will be doing soon as we plant our plants. So I just wanted to share those with you because they are so cute. You can print them on any kind of paper you like. I just use white mat because, you know, it's the cheapest option. And most people just use white mat stickers. So anyway, I'm so excited about that. I spent a couple of hours actually printing all of them out. It took a long time. All right, guys. So now that I've had that whole planner chat, let's actually get into the thick of it. Let's review goals. So I'm going to go to my brain, my brain tab, my goal tab. And we're going to look at my goals for the quarter. So again, it is May. I haven't checked any of these off. Probably haven't done anything though, <laughs> to be quite honest. So birthdays have passed. Mother's Day is coming up next weekend. Today is already the 4th. Oh, it's May the 4th. Be with you. Ha ha ha. Okay. Um... I can't even cross off my son's immunization date because that's on Friday. Yeah, so nothing has even happened yet. Um, I'm almost done my book. I've been reading twice a day. I've been reading like half an hour during the day and then half an hour at night. So as you can see, I'm like more than half done, which is so cool. And actually this book is growing on me. It's getting really good. And I, I got rid of all my coven books. So I read them and I actually de-stashed. I'm so proud of myself. I just have like the good books that I kept on my shelf, like my Karen Marie Monning books and my um, Sarah J Mass books. I kept those ones. Okay. I don't know why I put my pen away. Oh, this is from my Jane's Agenda 
um, simple kit that I did a video on. You're going to hear a bird a lot in that video, but that posts on Friday. So check that one out. I'll, I'll link that video for you guys. Um, but yeah, it's beautiful. I put that on this calendar, like, because I didn't want to cover up any of the other, the other ones because I like them all. Um, all right. So let's go to the week goals now. <laughs> weekly goals. Now I'm not sure whether I should do this again. I didn't do so well this week guys. I don't know. I, I was behind on Monday because my mom came over because of the bird. Sunday was busy because we had the birthday party for my daughter and Monday I was behind and then Tuesday, I, Tuesday and Wednesday I played catch up so yesterday was Wednesday and yeah i've been struggling to play catch up so i didn't even hardly do any of the new things on my list which i feel kind of like oh you know i didn't even get to my stickers yesterday but that's the plan for today so i'm hoping to film and edit this video before my kids wake up so that i have today to just focus on sticker creation and i'm probably going to do something in regards to budget because i haven't posted anything on my website in a long time that's new I've been working on like the same old thing and I haven't even posted it. So I'll probably do the same thing here. Okay, so for my progressive task card, that's what these are officially called. I used to use them as compass card, but this is actually a compass card. Okay, I'm going to zoom out a little bit. Oops, not in, out. Okay, so this is actually a compass card, and I put it in the page finder, like this plastic protective page finder. Um, and then this is a progressive task list. So I will be using them kind of like that now, I guess. <laughs> so dentist, I still have not called the dentist back. I don't know. I'm dreading it. I'm lazy. I don't know. Period tracker, I did. Weight tracker, I made. Melody check-in, I have been checking in every morning. I've been so good at that. I have been drinking more water now because it has been extremely hot here and I have been so thirsty. So I have been drinking my water and I haven't done any singing practice this week. Um, I just haven't had time. It's just been a time thing. So for business, I have... I, yesterday I started doing my brainstorming for my blog so I've been going it back into my commonplace book and just kind of reviewing what I've written over the last couple of years and I did a whole hour yesterday so I was so lucky my son slept from like two 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 and a half hours yesterday I spent time outside with my daughter and while I did that I did this um, I did other stuff as well but I feel really good about where I am right now I do have a blog idea in mind for Tuesday already so that's good but I want to do another hour today so you'll see that in my plans um, but none of these things I haven't updated my website I haven't done the YouTube default and I haven't done any face-to-face -face vids yet I want to it's still a goal it's going to like carry on to next week um, branches nope basement paperwork nothing did the bedding haven't done the landings and haven't cleaned the couch um, swimming, we're going to try to go swimming on Sunday, so that'll still be up. Movie night on Friday. My son is kind of like getting interested in the Titanic, so we might watch Titanic. There's this other movie I'll show you guys. My mom, this looks like a scary movie. My mom lent me this, so I'm not sure what this is about, but um, I might check this out. Okay, um, percussions, I still have to work on that. Um, I do have these, which I mentioned last time. They're called chest percussors. I got them from Amazon, got two of them for 18 bucks, and it's meant to help you, so I'm gonna try doing this today, okay? Um, as for journaling, everything was good, except for human design. I really wanted to start it, and I didn't. This is the Hobonichi I'll be, or the Hobonichi. This is the Stology book I'll be using. So I took out, I had a whole bunch of other stuff in here, so I cut out the pages, and then I added these journaling pages in here. This is from Planning with Kay, just to make it pretty. Okay, so the journaling one, and then I'm going to start on these pages here, and then work my way through. Um, I just have to start. And I haven't, but I will. Um, but I will be putting this Stology in my Planners Anonymous cover when it comes. 
because that is an A5 and that cover is also A5. Okay, so I will be attempting to work on those still. Um, I haven't called my friend Tressa, but I did um, write a letter to her. I sent that Monday, Tuesday. I sent it on Tuesday and we did not have a friend barbecue. Our friends canceled on us um, because one, two of them were like they had a cough. So that was that was what happened there. Okay. As for my compass card, uh, again, journaling was good. None of the other stuff got worked on. So the dentist, singing, tarot, journaling, nothing. Face-to-face -face videos, no. I haven't done anything under artist. Um, I did do this. This did not happen. Date night. Um, that won't happen until possibly next Friday. So I don't know why I put that. That might have been for last one. We did go last time, just not. We're not going this Friday. Um, Connor school, playtime outside. We have birthday party was good. Connor school. I think about school work. It's coming along. Um, he had a spelling test on Monday. He didn't do so well. And he had a science test yesterday or Tuesday. So I hope he did better on that. It was Tuesday. It was open book because they're trying to get away from, they started testing in grade three and the kids have like been not doing so well. So they're trying to do open book test. the curriculum here has changed this year and it's a lot tougher for kids nowadays um for daughter i did breakfast did barbecue hugs but no bookshelf okay all right so i'm gonna go ahead um let's see set new goals i'm going to write out um both my compass card and my progressive task list again Right, guys so we'll quickly go over this now so sharpen the saw i've got dentist singing melody and water trying to keep it simple trying to minimize all of the writing business website update facebook update youtube default i really want to work on that it probably won't even take that long and face-to-face -face videos home trim branches paperwork in the basement and both the landings at least um i should have had other stuff there because i know me and my husband wanted to do stuff this weekend oh yeah pop bottles that are chilling and we're gonna buy plants this weekend it's gonna be a big planting focus this weekend for wife mom movie night barbecue swim percussions outside time because it's just been so nice out Journaling is all of the things I usually put on here. And then other, talk with my friend, trim my dog, and then clean the birdcage. And then for my actual compass card, I've got um, dentist under physical, journaling under social emotional, and human design under mental. I left spiritual blank this time. Um, CEO, definitely focusing on the face-to-face -face videos. And also, I am going to add blog um, brainstorm on there again because I'm still not done. For artists, I've got cross-stitch hang picks. I was going to add lettering, but I just figured I can, I don't need to add all the things in one week. I can focus on that next time. Call my friend Tressa for wife and mom. Outside time, barbecue, swimming, homework on my, for my son. Like focus, like try to maintain that. 
and then daughter just try to be more compassionate because I tend not to be when it comes to my mom and I, I want to be. All right, so that is it for looking at the new goals. So let's take a look at the calendar now, see what we have going on for the next upcoming week. We are looking from the 8th to the 14th. So pretty much the same thing. I do have date night on here. I don't know if we'll be going for sure, but it is garbage next week and then Mother's Day on the Sunday. So I have to do some brainstorming, figure out what I want to do for that. Um, now let's look at, that's the month view calendar. Let's do month tasks, let's see if there's anything I can carry over. Um, flowers will be taken care of this weekend, probably. I don't know about mowing because our grass isn't that long yet. Doing in the garden. And I have to remember to do weekly reviews. So I, I had to go back and like do that last month, but it was like almost too late at that point. So I want to be more, more focused and on time this time. Um, business stuff. I haven't done that yet. Commonplace book brainstorm I have, which is good. And daily tidy of desk area. I should focus on that a little bit too. So probably transfer some of this stuff over for the current week. Um, when we look at the week, I can tell you right now that I've hardly got anything done. So it's been, it's been one of those weeks. <laughs> um, yeah, I haven't done anything. Oh, I feel like such a, I don't want to say failure, but I feel like I feel like I've been so lazy. <laughs> I'm just going to do this monthly habit tracker. Whoops. While we're here. Um, I did this. Water. I did really good. Medical. Yes. Sleep. No. <laughs> Shower. No. Reading. Yes. Journal. I have. 10 minute tidy. I did. Expenses. Yesterday. I did. Oh, wait. No, this is the fourth. Wow. I should have done this on Sunday. What am I doing? Good thing this is in white because I can just do this. Okay. Okay, water for the third. Yes. Medical, yep. Reading, journaling, 10 minute tidy. YouTube post. Uh, did I have a YouTube post yesterday? Yeah, I did. It was my budget recap. Um, I edited yesterday and I worked on... Yesterday was Wednesday, so I didn't do any stickers. I was supposed to, I just didn't. Okay. Um, now this is, I haven't actually put my blog ideas here yet, but I'll come back to this and this is where I'll put them. And then I also put the sheet I wrote everything on. I've got like a couple of sheets. I'll put that into my work binder. Okay, so plan with me, we're doing right now. I should cross off. I did the jeans agenda for some reason i thought i had got the may sterling ink sub box but i did not so mine won't be coming till like for june so it'll be coming the end of may i think which is too bad because i was really looking forward to that <laughs> um hobonichi i did ig reel for may setup i'm not sure what i was talking about there may setup i don't know um, that's all I did there. I should write my stats in. So I'll take my stats from my main page. Like I, in my business planner, I write out all of my stats anyway. Okay. So then this is the week. I never did any of this stuff. Like I feel so lazy. Yep. Nothing. Not a single one. Nothing, nothing, nothing. <laughs> All right. Um, next, we want to check inbox. I haven't actually checked this in a while. Pretty much all the same things. I did organize the kids' toys. And Jane's agenda. Yep. I did pretty much have all of those th same things all already on my task list. So I don't even have to refer to this after. Um, okay. So now we are ready to plan the week. So let's go to the week. And I'm just going to get the week out in this planner as well as my business planner.
So I think I'm all done here. I'm going to start listening to my own advice and actually putting like goals and tasks on the weekly schedule because I do know that if I forget to put stuff on, I do miss it, right? I don't think about it because it's not in front of me. So I added um, YouTube default, what update website, Facebook update. So every time I have a sticker design that a new one they'll release, I will post it to my Facebook page and then or any orders that I have like I always take pictures of them and then put them on my Facebook page and then also I'm not planning hardly anything for Wednesday it looks like a lot but it's not budget only takes like half an hour in the morning sticker design is what I'm going to focus on that's going to be like the focus on Wednesday because I just have to make it like that I have to intentionally focus on it okay and then I don't know what blog I'll be writing yet so I left that blank but I also scheduled face-to-face -face video. I need my husband to be home. So you know what? It actually, even though I said I wouldn't be working on the, on the, um, I wouldn't be working on the weekend. I'm going to film it. So what I should do is schedule a day. I think Wednesday is actually a good day for that. Maybe I will cross that off there. Um, I'm going to start posting that video every Wednesday. I think that's why it hasn't even been done yet, just because I haven't been intentional with like, you know, scheduling it in. So face-to-face -face video, and it'll be like a weekly update video, kind of telling you guys what's going on, but like where you can see my face. It's not just, you know, whatever. So I'll give myself time to edit because what I'll do is film it here. So film face-to-face -face video. So whether I do it Saturday or Sunday, it doesn't really matter. Um, I'll just put it there. 
so that I do it. And then that's only really work I have to do on the weekend. I'm trying not to do any weekend work. That's my goal. Except I'll post like a picture of my plan with me, but that's about it. Okay, so my blog, um, How to Make Your Planner Pretty, that's being posted on Monday. I will have a makeup Monday for the 8th. Um, my Monday journaling, of course. And yeah, so I'm actually going to try to be more intentional this week um, and actually like schedule those things in on top of what I already do because, um, yeah, it's I need to do that in order for it to get done. So I'm going to put this one back in my work planner now. Put the month with the month. <clears throat> I'm just also going to put my stickers away at the same time and then we can quickly talk about my week so I feel like um it doesn't look that busy but honestly guys like a lot of these tasks take many hours so it's not just not just me sitting here having fun even though I do enjoy what I do <laughs> all right so that's for my work for my week I'm loving my vintage auroras too by the way like they're so beautiful I feel so good when I'm in them Okay, so now for this week, we already discussed all of the goal stuff. Um, let's find the week. So I put all of my themes at the top. So it'd be journal, blog, sticker day, budget, plan with me, catch up. And then school, pay bills. I just put the most important things on each day. Um, take out garbage on the Thursday. Take out like you know, food takeout on Friday, movie night, swimming on Saturday. I moved it to Saturday instead of Sunday only because um, Mother's Day and I don't know what we're doing for Mother's Day. So I just wanted to have it free and clear. My only reminder for the week is Mother's Day and goals are the face-to-face -face video. So I will start that this weekend. And then the landing, so the upstairs and the downstairs and then the planting. So it'll be a big focus. It'll be like my husband will be all dirty because he'll be doing the rotor chilling for me. I do not get near to that thing, but I will be planting. So what I could do is, um, oh, I should also write, um, maybe I'll do that next week. Like, I can't believe we're already planning for this week. Um, reminder, I'm going to do a packing list for Red Ear because we'll be doing that on the May Long. Packing list Red Deer. And um, I also want to do like a... Um, like a plan, planning, planting list. So like planting list, kind of like a map of where I want stuff. So I, I am within a budget. I have $280 to work with. Last year I spent $600. <laughs> so it might be a challenge for me to go from $600 to $280. So we'll see how it goes. I am planning on getting um, cheap soils. Sometimes I was mentioning before what people like Walmart will do, for instance, is if they're opening um, bags of soil, they will accidentally slash the bag when they're opening it on the pallet and taking off the plastic. And they will discount those at a really, like a highly discounted rate. Like I'm talking like $2 from like, you know, $15. So I buy those because you know, they might be able to dry it out, but they're still good. I think the most costly thing other than the flowers for me for planting season <clears throat> is probably the watering, paying for the water and the fertilizer. I think that's the most costly thing, um, but I don't have to fertilize right away because the soil I buy usually has fertilizer in it, but then I fertilize once a week usually um, to keep my flowers looking gorgeous. So I won't be doing any vegetables, I don't think, this year because my vegetables haven't been turning out that well in recent years and it's kind of a waste and they just go to waste and I don't even eat them. Um, so no vegetables, I'll just make the yard look pretty and do some flowers because yeah, I don't want to be out there watering 100% of the time and I'll do flowers like petunias are really pretty, but they're also easy. So they do wither if they don't get enough water, but they come back really quickly. They grow really fast and they're always pretty. So Anyway, um, thank you guys so much for watching this plan with me. I really appreciate that those of you who have stuck around are still around. <laughs> and um, 
I, you know, if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them down below and um, click on the bell button if you want to be notified when I post new content. I will have those um, weekly face-to-face -face videos. I'm going to try to have them up for next week, or at least I'll have the one up for next week, and we can kind of see how my progress is going. If you're new, please subscribe. I would love to have you. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys again next week. Bye, friends.